okay so let's go ahead and create a substrate machine and let's name this as single hand melee attack let's move this right here and let's open this up let's move the entry any and exec state right there okay and just as we did for the fist fight we created a fist fight locomotion and then we added the fighting animations okay so we'll do the same for this one as well so let's create a new blend tree let's name this as single hand melee and in here we will create three motion fields in the first one let's add the idle oops okay selected drag and drop the idle then we need to add the walk so let's try and drop the walk and then at last we have the run so we will drag and drop the run motion in there okay so now if we play it as you can see the locomotions will happen like this okay so now we have the locomotion set up now let's add the animations so first of all we will be adding this attack a1 edge melee which is this attack okay so let's drag and drop it right here then after this we need the animation which is by the name of this attack b1 h melee let's drag and drop it right here then after this we need the attack c forward 1 h melee so let's draw, drag and drop it then after this we need this one which is 2 hit combo a1 h melee so let's drag and drop this one as well and at the last we need this one okay which is by the name of three hit combo a forward one edge melee so let's rename them as well so the first one will be single attack one then let's name this as single attack two this one to single attack three this will be the 4 and this one will be the 5 so now when you set up the animations like this now let's go ahead and create parameters for them so the first parameter will be by the name of single hand attack active I know the name is a little bit lengthy but you can name this whatever you want then right here the next parameter will be similar to the name of this animation okay which we name it right here by the name of single attack one so we will name this as single attack one as well okay then we will create another one and this time we will name this as single attack two then single attack three then single attack 4 and the last one will be 5 so first of all we need to assign the first parameter so how we will do that we will get back to the base layer and from the basic locomotion we will make a transition to the single hand melee attack and in here in the states let's select the single hand melee ok if you open this up now as you can see the transition is coming to this okay let me show you the preview as you can see then let's make a transition from this back to the basic locomotions and as you can see it is like this okay the color of it is fade away so this is because we need to make a transition from this single hand melee to this base layer and 
when we click on this base layer it will give you this options and right here select basic locomotions that is it and now as you can see it is perfectly fine now let's select the first transition and right here remove as exact time and set this single hand detect to true then select the other transition right here we will set this to false that is it now let's go inside and set this transition as well so we will make transitions like this okay then when you create transition for all of them let me now select the first one from this transition remove as exact time and in the condition select this single attack one set this to true then select the other transition right here we don't need to remove this as exact time right here we will just simply change the condition so we will set this to false okay then select this one right here from the first one we need to remove the as exact time and select single attack to set this to true then select the other one don't remove that just simply change the condition and in the same way we will be doing it for the next three so right here we will remove that and select single attack three set it to true select the other one whoops okay select the other one don't remove that and set the single attack three to false okay then remove that from the fourth one now set it to true and right here just set it to false that is it now let's select this one remove as exact time set it to true and then in the other one just simply set it to false this is it for this single hand melee attack animation so as you can see now the animations and parameters everything is all set up now in the next video we will play this animation by using the script